Okay, let's get to our weather right now. Winter weather, a winter, winter weather advisory. Yes, that's uh, what you meant. Repetition there. Yes. <laughs> Heat the big advisory. I'm so sorry. Vanessa's here and for Lonnie with an update. This is a what second time this week? Yeah, last night and just you know put it on repeat tonight. The thing is, it's also not very impressive. The system moving on in. In fact, for most of us, it will be rain overnight. We've got rain approaching as we look live outside. 45 degrees. It is mild. Hence the reason most of us will see rain. Your headlines. We can't roll out slick spots, especially north and west of the city where. We we do have that winter weather advisory until 7 a.m. Generally speaking, the next several days to wrap the year are unsettled and warm. Thankfully, things are looking good for New Year's Eve. Here's a look at what we expect through tonight into tomorrow morning. A coating to maybe one inch of snow at most with a bit of an icy glaze for areas north and northwest of the city. But you see so many of us here highlighted in green because the system will bring mainly rain. So 60% chance of wet weather now through 7 a.m. Then again, late Wednesday night through Thursday, another chance for more wet weather, but it's looking very unimpressive at this point in time. New Year's Eve day and through the stroke of midnight is looking dry. That's really good news, but not long after we ring in the new year, a more significant system moves in, bringing a better chance for some soaking rain. As you look at the temperature trend, it is one of persistent warming. Tomorrow, 45, which is above the norm by four, and then by the first day of 2022, nearly 60 degrees. And then the numbers crash into the start of next week. Temperatures right now, 45 in the city, 40 in White Plains, very mild out here with the exception of Monticello. Again, the reason why most of us get rain. But we have seen some reports of about a half an inch of snow to the northwest of the region, but just outside the viewing area, we've got rain streaming on in. It will be moderate for the next couple of hours. And then things will start to wind down by tomorrow morning. So here we go, showing you what it looks like at 1.30, steady, light to moderate rainfall, 5 a.m., that steadier rain is pushing out to the east, and then we're just left some residual showers through midday. Much of the afternoon hours are dry, but not necessarily bright. And then as we make our way Wednesday night and a Thursday to the south, a chance for rain. Otherwise, Thursday looking relatively dry compared to what we saw yesterday, with just a minimal chance for showers. Tomorrow, it is going to be a temperature topping out at 45 with some morning drizzle, a little drier for afternoon. And as we look at the extended forecast, Thursday 49 with chance for showers, dry for New Year's Eve day and warm. 52 partly sunny stroke of midnight, mid 40s and dry. Then 59 Saturday with rain likely. Sunday lingering wet weather and then those numbers crash into the 30s mm. for the first work week of the new year. Mm. Dana and Dick, back to you. Okay, thanks.